Trade affects citizen prosperity, which is in turn influenced by the environment. Whether it's efficient ports, tech-savvy institutions, localized accredited labs and production facilities, a favorable business environment can increase trade opportunities by embracing innovation and efficiency. The government of Belize, the Caribbean Development Bank, the European Union and other strategic partners are working together in Belize on four projects valued at over 3 million Belize dollars to enhance cross-border trade. At the Belize Agricultural Health Authority, public officers will be leveraging technology to increase efficiency, lower cost and expand the availability of e-services with the first project. The CDB funded uh, project is for the development of a um, risk-based SPS import and export control uh, system. As uh, an organization that is <coughs> related or, or does work to support trade, both in import and export, we have been looking to forward to develop capacities uh, especially technological uh, capacities to improve the services to, to those people who import as well as, as those who, who export. The Belize Bureau of Standards is being provided with equipment and training through the EU-funded EPA and CSME standby facility. This financing will expand available testing services to its clients. I think from the, f the perspective of trade, uh, it allows us to become more competitive. Uh, if we develop our services internally and if we can develop our calibration measurement capabilities, it allows us to, to put Belize on the map in terms of, of doing calibration that is internationally recognized so that um, a factory, a producer can have a certificate that is not only recognized nationally, but it's one that is recognized regionally and internationally. In Toledo, a new facility, also with EU support, is being constructed for use by small-scale farmers. It will be managed by the Toledo Cacao Growers Association. This, along with equipment, training and marketing assistance, will encourage greater participation of farmers along the cacao and chocolate value chain and increase members' earnings. The project will allow the farmers to have a sense of ownership in the enterprise of growing cacao processing, including up to the distribution to the end consumer. This process will further create employment for the many unemployed women and youths in our era that currently do not have these opportunities. To increase efficiency of exports and imports at the ports of entry, the Belize Customs and Excise Department will undertake a time-release study to identify bottlenecks and implement strategies to address them to the benefit of consumers and the wider private sector. This will make the trading environment better for the, the public, um, the business community. It also lead to like transparency and accountability and, and um, predictability, which the trading community needs in order to make informed decisions. With these initiatives and partnerships, several institutions will become more robust and service oriented. Greater trade will also be facilitated. The impact of this multi-agency collaboration will be felt by everyone involved in commerce as we continue to enable growth and support economic resilience by transforming lives through trade.